What's going on people? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Lee Chappie. By the way, before we get into it, big thank you for all of the views on this video. Our previous video hit 2.5 thousand views and we're on our way now to 18k subscribers. Thank you all for the continued support. Make sure you follow me at Lee underscore Chappie on all socials and subscribe to the channel. Right, here we go. As I just mentioned, previous video, if you do want to go and check it out, easy to do, stadium expansion news, bits and bobs, go and have a look, simple as that, just click it. So, Leicester, City, apparently, according to Sky Sports News, are looking at two, two, not one, two, two wingers before transfer deadline day. Right? There's rumblings, there's all sorts going on at the minute, and we're going to get right into it. We're going to dig deep into who's going out, who's rumoured to be going out, who's coming in, blah de blah So, Sky Sports News tweeted out, and to be fair, there's a video with it. Uh, the club apparently are working on deals for Sporting Lisbon's uh, Fatua Wu. Yeah, uh, God knows if I can get that name right. I don't even know who this guy is. I'm not going to pretend I do, but here's some footage of the guy in action. Yeah, looks pretty good, to be fair. Now, we've had plenty of wingers coming in. We know that, you know, I don't need to go into it. The amount that we've had, we've had The Undertaker. We've had the Richard Gazal fake Mores. We've had everyone come in. We've had the failed Brazilian Tete. Ugh, the list goes on. But Leicester are also apparently looking at another one. Galatasaray's Eunice Akgun. Okay, check this one out as well. Here's a little bit of footage for you. Um, I don't know these players. But that says nothing. Because I didn't know who Riyad Mahrez was. Not saying these are going to be Riyad Mahrez. I'm not comparing them to him. Don't worry, I've not lost my head yet. But Leicester City, according to Sky Sports, are interested in these two wingers. Let me know in the comments if you know anything about these. Are they ballers? Let me know. Now, in the same article, uh, Sky have, have suggested that Castagna is in advanced talks on moving away from the club now. Um, one can assume it's Juventus. I'm not sure who else would bring Castagna in, although <laughs> I've seen someone on Twitter put Liverpool, but I, I, don't, I don't even understand how that's going to happen. But it looks like Castagna is due to be on his way, the Belgium international, who's been here for quite some time and had a very good spell here at Leicester. Um, I like Castagna. I think he's pretty good. Um, I prefer him probably on the left side than the right. I prefer Ricardo on the right when you've got the option of two. Um, but Ricardo's moving to a different role in at, at the moment under Maresca. So Castagna, Sky, Advanced Talks. <sighs> and with two players potentially coming in, Unfortunately, there's going to be some going out. We already know this. Maresca said that they've got to get some players out before we get some in. It's a, looking a little like Christensen is going out on loan with an option to buy to Bologna. OK, talk are in progress. Uh, I have no idea how true this is. This has come from a Twitter account at Nico Shira. Now, he's some sort of reporter, which has now been backed up according to Twitter by... Fabrizio Romano, that he's medicals due and everything else. So it looks like poor old Victor, uh, who I thought looked half decent when he came in, is now Christiansen's in, in, in way out the door. Are you feeling like this is a bad idea? Have we got enough backup? Have we got enough players coming back now from injury, like James Justin and stuff? <sighs> I don't know. It's a, it's a strange one. Uh, I thought... It, I didn't think he was going anywhere. I honestly thought, yeah, he's going to be good. But a lot of people on Twitter in particular don't rate him. 
So, do you rate him? Do you rate him? Let me know. And with another player going out, this one's going to hurt. According to Football Insider, this is an exclusive from them yesterday. I missed this, but it's here now in all its glory. Patson Dakar, £23 million Leicester are ready to apparently accept £23 million for Mr. Zambia Patson Dakar. Don't know how true it is. Let's just have a quick read on this one. Uh, sources are saying that Dakar is on his way out for £23 million. He's only 24 and it's looking like Monaco are looking at Dakar. And obviously, despite Leicester, you know, not wanting to do the deal, apparently they want to recoup some of that £23 million that they spent on Pats and Dakar from Salzburg only two years ago, 18 months ago, something like that. So, <laughs> look. I think it's all down to if Kalichi Nacho goes out. And we'll talk to about Kalichi Nacho in just a second. But I do not want Pats and Dakar to go, personally. I don't feel he's he's been as good as we thought he was going to be. When he first came in, smashing goals left, right and centre in Europa. But now, Kalichi Nacho is the main man. So, we go on to Kalichi Nacho next. Because from the same report, Football Insider is reporting that a big move for Mr. Kalichi Nacho um, to Saudi Arabia could be on the cards. I've also seen some rumblings of Crystal Palace interested in Kalichi Nacho. We've seen links to Forest as well. Look, it's the 1st of September is the deadline day. I'm a bit worried that we're going to we're going to, you know, some of our players are going to get pulled along. That's my biggest worry because I think if we keep on to the players we've got, Ricardo Pereira is another one that's been linked out. If we can just keep on to these main players like Nacho, Ricardo, uh, Dakar, I, I still think we should keep on to Christensen personally. I think we'll boss the championship. We've been looking good under Maresca. 10% to 20% of his style of play is implemented. He's far from where he wants to be apparently, so, so the bold one says. But... We're still grinding out the wins. And I think straight back up, straight back up Leicester City. And to finish off the video, I'm pretty certain we should play the video that the Leicester fans sing. <laughs> yeah, straight back up, straight back up, fighting. On a serious note, who do you want to stay? Who do you want to go? Well, how much money do we need and how much money do we spend? We've got a very good squad, strong squad, some good players that have come in. But there's rumblings. There's rumblings of Fars going to Spurs. There's all sorts going on right now. I'm a bit worried about who goes out over the next seven days. We'll soon find out. Rotherham is coming up away Saturday. Watch a long time. Be here. I'll be here. She'll see you very, very soon on the channel. Thank you for all the support. Thank you for the views. See you on the next video.